there are certain situations where the non-profit may also uh, uh, produce a statement of profit and loss or um, some uh, places refer this as a trading account okay uh, several sources will say this as a trading account so trading account will shows the will show a uh, specific activity uh, specific um, profit generating activity of the non-profit organization so for example if the uh, the um, the club has a cafe okay it's a club it's a non-profit organization uh, for the pursuit of the members uh, needs but then they also have a cafe and that cafe generates profit so uh, they will need to produce um, a trading account or trading statement that shows the the sale from the cafe minus the cost of goods sold of the cafe and uh, which brings to the the uh, gross profit so that gross profit that profit will then be channeled into the income section of the uh, statement of income and expenses the final uh, statement that no non-profit organizations usually produce is the statement of financial position it is similar to the balance sheet uh, as for profit organizations um, so they would have the asset section it will they will have the liability section but for the equity section uh, it is not called equity but it is called the um, net asset section and the account and the under the equity section is not cap, uh, you uh, called capital account but it is called uh, accumulated funds so for for sole proprietorship under um, owners equity there will be a capital account uh, for partnership there will be a capital uh, capital for the part for the uh, partner okay the capital account for the partner for the um, uh, corporates it will be the equity share uh, or the preference share but for a non-profit organization it will be called accumulated funds for accumulated funds like i said it is used instead of capital um, in a sole trader or proprietary shape the accounting equation uh, that is used in the uh, balance sheet is the uh, owner's equity section plus the liability is equal to assets okay um, but for non-profit making organization it is uh, net assets uh, plus liability and equals to um, assets so accumulated funds will be under net assets uh, surplus of income over expenditure will increase the accumulated fund and the excess of expenditure over income will decrease the accumulated fund okay so any any surplus of income uh, of a particular year will increase the accumulated funds of the non-profit organization and if there is any loss or excess of expenditure in the current year that will decrease the accumulated uh, the amount of the accumulated fund so this is the format of the statement of financial position so again there's the asset section so here you will show uh, the cash uh, for example the sports equipment the building and also if you have a uh, uh, accrued sales subscription where members have not yet paid uh, the subscription fee for the current year and then you will have the liability section where you have uh, bank loans for example the advanced subscription or the um, other words could be uh, deferred subscri subscription or uh, unearned subscription so these uh, liability accounts because uh, members have paid for subscription uh, for the following year but they have paid it in the current year okay so that is a liability um, and then the third section will be the net assets under net assets there will be the accumulated funds uh, which in, would include the um, which will have the surplus of income or excess of uh, expenses of the current year so we total up the liability and the net assets that will equal the uh, assets